Hi everyone, welcome to another video. So, I thought I'd vlog today. Don't know if I'm back, don't know, maybe, we'll see. But I thought I would bring you along with me today because I have a lot to do. I need some motivation and what better way to motivate myself than vlog. We'll see, oh, my stomach's rumbling. Um, I have no plans today. I have a lot to do, but I have no plans. So. I'm going to try and get as much done as I can. My house is an absolute mess. It's actually disgusting. It's not actually disgusting. It's just messy. Um, I'll show you some bits that I've done. Because this weekend has been a very good weekend. I did so much this weekend. Um, I got rid of the door that was here. The door that was here. Moved the fridge to the top of the freezer. Because... I am going to be putting a tumble dryer where the fridge used to be so there's a lot of little random bits going on right now but my flat is just a big fat mess so I need to kind of sort it all out um, my room I have moved it around I don't like looking at this because it's just horrible um, yeah that's basically it right now so, yeah, I have a lot to do. Also, have some hoodies to make. I have um, some online paperwork kind of stuff to do. So, I think I might get that out of the way first. Get the hoodies ready to send. And then, and then what? And then what? I don't know. I don't know. Let me do the hoodies first because I think that's the most important thing right now. So, I'm going to get my laptop and sort it all out and I'll show you what I do. So my desk is an absolute mess, so before I do anything, I'm going to sort it all out and clear it all up so I have space to actually work. While I'm doing this, I might as well talk to you because I just I get bored when I'm tidying up, so I just wanna talk. Normally I'm on the phone or doing other things like watching TV or listening to music or something. But I thought I'd just talk because I have some things to say. There's a lot of there's a lot of changes that have happened lately and I've just become a different person. I just feel like I'm 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 a new person. So if you guys don't like this new person that I am, then you can just unfollow me because I don't want people following me who don't support me and who don't like what I do because the only thing that leads to is negativity and negativity is not welcome on my channel so i would rather have less followers than negativity around my channel now how cute are these though these little um things that i bought are from shein so i got this for my friend's daughter she loves dinosaurs and she loves jewelry and then i bought all the kids these like little gummy bear type necklaces and stuff they're gonna love them so those are just random little presents for them. I also got some necklaces for Elisa, a little A, and then a little A for my friend's daughter, and a H for my friend's other daughter, but two of the little things are missing. These are from Shein, so I wouldn't recommend these ones with the diamantes on them. Not great, but you live and you learn. I have been buying so much jewellery from Shein recently, it's just crazy, but I love it. You can get so many different, like, random quirky bits and bobs. These are the earrings I was wearing yesterday. I just love them, how simple they are, and they're not, like, hoops that go into your ear. They, like, go around, like, they're like a stud, and then the hoop hangs off the stud, and I think they're really cute. So, those, and they're so cheap as well, like, one, one, two pound max for earrings. <laughs> And these ones, look how cute these ones are. So simple, but so gorgeous. Wow. Like I used to get free clothes from Shein, but I haven't had free clothes from them for ages. But I've still been buying clothes from them because I just love their clothes so much. Um, but yeah. Anyway, uh, what was I saying? What was I going to say? To order hoodies as well, you can either DM me on Instagram. Or you, or you can send an email to safirahickson at hotmail.com and then I will reply and send you the details of where to pay for it and if you have anything you want to know. And there is also 
a website, safslife.com, but that website is going to be closing down soon, so I'm going to be doing it all through Instagram. So if you're not on Instagram, what are you doing? Get on Instagram. If you're not on Instagram, then you can just email superiorlipson at hotmail.com because that's where I do all of my business -y emails. So, yes, um, I have so many bits and bobs like them. It's really stressful, but we're getting there. We're one step at a time. We're not stressing out anymore. I just, I feel like I've had enough stress in my life and I've had enough of it. So, um, I just want to take everything as it comes. Speaking of stress, this should have stressed me out more than it did this morning. I dropped the kids off at school and then I was driving home and there's like these mini roundabouts on the road that I have to go on. Um, and these people decided to cross over um, as I was taking a left onto the road. But obviously I had to stop because they were already on the road. Um, so I stopped and then she, one of them crossed, one of them decided to go because the other one was like halfway crossed. And then a car went into the back of me, which is stupid, it's so stupid. I got out of the car was like, did you not see me? He was like, oh sorry, I didn't see you. I was like, you idiot. And then I checked my car, Ted took a good look at his car. I'm so bad at like remembering names and uh, models of cars and stuff. So. Um, I know that it's got like a mashallah sticker on the front and then the number plate. I remember the number plate, so um, I don't really remember the make of the car. But I've seen that car a few times around the school. So, if I find anything on my car, which I don't think there is anything, then I know who he is. He's going to get it. He's going to get it. Anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, so that didn't stress me out as much as I thought it was going to. Which is great because a few weeks ago, if that happened, I would have like broken down and cried and been like, oh, I don't know why does everything bad happen to me? Like at one point I was just like, nothing is ever going to go right. But now my mindset is changing and I'm just like, it is what it is. Everything happens for a reason and you can't control everything. So you might as well just make the most out of what happens and what you're given so yes that's it also i put a mask in my hair yesterday and it feels soft but i don't know i feel i need a haircut i do i just saw a ghost out the corner of my anyway i have been cooking loads recently um and I have decided that I am going to be on a weight loss mission. So I'm going to take you guys on that journey with me. Um, I'm going to do a lot of cooking, meal prep type videos. I'm going to tell you how mine is going. Like I always say I'm going to do these things, but I never do. But I am determined to do it this time because why not? Like I feel like it would help so many people because I get this is like one of the main questions that I get asked is how did you lose weight? Um, I've put a bit of weight back on I'm not gonna lie and like I don't mind like I, I don't really care but I did feel better when I was the way I was before. Do you know? So I'm doing it for me I'm doing it to feel good and I'm just I just want to be happier with myself. So, yes, that is what is going on with me right now. Um, the kids have both had chicken pox over the last few weeks, which is great <laughs> because it's out of the way now. It's all gone. And they're fine. They are happy, um, which is good. Uh, Elisa was very nervous about going into school today, but I got one of the mentors to have a word with her and he did and she seemed fine because she she likes him and she sees him at lunchtime and he was like, I'm going to give you a big high five at lunchtime and we'll sing some songs and blah blah blah. I don't know what they said, like they, they just had a little work chat before she went into school. But yeah, that is what happened this morning um, I've hardly slept I was I w just couldn't sleep last night like I always fall asleep with the kids and then I wake up 
and last night I had to wash my hair and everything so I did that and then I wasn't asleep until like three o'clock in the morning and then I was on do you know when you go online and you order stuff why why did I do it I ordered so much crap I ordered an espresso coffee machine which I'm not mad about like I do love myself for doing that because I have wanted one for a long time I'm getting rid of my air fryer because it's a load of crap basically is like an oven it's an oven you don't need an air fryer why like it cooks the food in the same amount of time I don't know I'm just maybe I just don't know how to use it properly but I prefer using my oven so I'm just gonna stick with my oven yeah so then I'll have space for my uh, an espresso machine which is exciting because I just love coffee and Nespresso is like I used to have a Nespresso machine and it was amazing so hopefully this one will be great too I can't wait I'm so excited and then I ordered some gym stuff even though I'm not going to go to the gym I just feel like I want some um, workout clothes so it motivates me to work out at home uh, <laughs> and then I ordered another £40 worth of crap on Shein so yeah last night was a very expensive night of fun times anyway I had better be quiet and get crack a lack in with what I'm doing so I will speak to you in a bit still cleaning I have had these really weird like dizzy spells like I close my eyes and my head just goes really dizzy and sometimes I stand up and I just feel like I'm gonna fall over so I don't know what's wrong with me I went I um spoke to my doctor um last week and she was like you just need to sleep and eat and drink water which I basically have been doing apart from last night and the night before and the night okay my sleep hasn't been the best but I don't know I feel like it's not that I know myself and I know that I can survive on how much sleep and food I have been having and I don't think it is that so I don't know so I'm currently cutting out a design and I am also changing my number because I've had two phone numbers because I've been trying to change my contract it's been very complicated so i'm trying to do that <laughs> but yeah we're getting there we're getting somewhere i'm getting things done today my hoodie orders are done i just need to pack them up and then post them so that's all done now i'm just hungry i just want food now <laughs> so i think i'm gonna make some food and then pack them up or put some eggs on to boil, then pack them up, and then eat, and then take them. <laughs> orders are ready to go I have two hoodies to post right now um, my eggs I've just finished boiling so I'm gonna quickly eat them and then I'm gonna go to my friend's house because um, I'm gonna get my car sorted so let's go see that let's go see what happens I don't really know I don't have a plan I'm just doing things so let's go um, cleaning can wait Okay, so I've just eaten my breakfast, which was two boiled eggs. Descendants. Does anybody know Descendants? If you do, let me know. That was um, a bag that I made for my niece, but I put it on the wrong way, so it came out a bit mushed up, but I'm not going to waste the bag. I'm going to use it. I'm going to be cool, like a tween. Anyway, uh, I'm about to head to my friend's house. I'm gonna get her to take me to the post office and then we'll see what happens.
So we just got home. I have the worst hay fever ever. I feel like crap. Elisa's here. She's had chicken pox, so she's got a chicken pocky face. <laughs> she's scabby now, so she's all right to go to school. No, uh, no. Uh, how was school today? How was school today, babe? Crap! <laughs> <laughs> Silly bum. Anyway, riding a rocket. We, what are we doing now then? Riding a rocket that like is for me. <laughs> That's so cool. I don't know if it's going backwards. We are, what are we going to do? We're going to make some dinner. Maybe go outside to play if the weather stays nice. But the main thing is to make some dinner first and then do that. I like to feed these guys early because when they get back from school, all they do is complain that they're hungry. Hungry! And then they want snacks, 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 snacks. So I like to give them dinner and then they don't ask for that many snacks. See Okay, bye, stop, bye. stop. So yeah, that's what we're gonna do now. The kids are going to have an ice lolly. I am going to start making, well, I think we're just gonna have pasta, simple today. Um, but I just feel really drained right now because I hardly slept last night and I just feel like sleeping. I went and chilled at my friend's house for a while before I went to pick the kids up and um, her boyfriend is a &H Graphics on Instagram and he does like stickers, vinyl stuff and he's, changing the color of my mirrors on my car and the stripes on my car and everything um to black and pink so once it's all done i will show you it so for dinner i've decided i'm going to make a pasta very simple um with some meatballs i've just got a little bag of meat out i'm gonna defrost it i always bag up my meat as thin as i can so that it takes a minute 10 minutes, 20 minutes max to defrost. And I'm just gonna put some hot water on it while I do the rest of it. Um, and then I'm going to show you what I do to make my meatballs. I'm also gonna drink a glass of water because I am feeling so thirsty right now. Oh my God. I just feel really tired and sleepy and thirsty and horrible. Mommy! Huh? Mommy! Yeah, baby. You smacked your bum? Yeah! Alisa, why are you smacking Lisa's bum? I'm going to show you how I'm going to make my meatballs. I'm going to mix all the spices in here. So I'm literally going to do, this is onion granules. So I'm going to do about a quarter of a teaspoon. Maybe a little bit more. A quarter of a teaspoon. Quarter of a teaspoon of garlic granules. I'm gonna put in a little bit of. Yeah, a little bit of mint, dried mint. A little bit of mixed herbs. Just oh, literally like less than a quarter of a teaspoon of all of them. If you're making more, you can put more in but I'm not making a lot because my kids don't eat it. I'm going to put in a bit of smoked paprika. I do like, a, I like it quite a bit, like half, more than, more than a quarter of a teaspoon. And then I'm gonna add some salt and pepper. And that is the mix for my meatballs all done. I'm literally just going to add this to the meat, mix it up, and then put it in. You just had an ice cream, baby. Get that box over there, look. See, with, on the other side. Go around the other side. There's some cookies in there. Yeah, there's biscuits. There's cookies, animal ones. Oh, boy. Thank you. Thank you. Anyway, so I'm just going to wait for this meat to defrost. I'm going to put the oven on so I can literally just put them straight into the oven once I've mixed it up and... Um, made them into little balls. I'm gonna make them very small so that they cook really quickly. And that's it, really. I'm also going to put the pasta onto boil. I'm gonna have. We're gonna have linguine, which is like spaghetti. The kids like it, and it's a little bit different than spaghetti. So that's what I'm going to put on now. I'm so tired, guys. I just feel really tired right now. I'm drained completely. Completely drained.
So, just taking the meatballs out of the oven. They are completely cooked. They took less than 10 minutes or something crazy like that. Um, I am currently looking for a spoon. This will do. I cannot be bothered to find a spoon. The kids are eating their pasta and cheese. Very exciting. I've put this pan on a high heat. Hello? Yes, sweetie, how can I help you? I've got the meatballs in here and I'm going to just put them straight into the pan. Like that. They're so hot. Ow, oh my god. And then I've got this pasta sauce which I got from Asda. It is literally just tomato and basil sauce. And I'm just going to pour it into this pan like that. And put this on low and just heat that all up and that's basically my meatball sauce all done um that's it really that's what i'm doing i uh, i think i'm actually going to add something else yet mm. nice i like that i do have this um soft cheese with red pepper and chili which i'm going to add to this too because i think it'll be really nice um so i'm just gonna add the rest of it because otherwise it's gonna go to waste I'm just gonna pour, put that into here, and mix it up, and then let it heat through. I'm gonna have my pasta with this, and then I'm gonna have some carrot batons with it, and that is my dinner all done. This is my food, cannot wait to eat it, I'm starving, yum yum yum. Oh yeah, that's right. This is Saf's life. Oh yeah, that's right. Oh yeah, this is Saf's life.